Happening tomorrow, the town of Pike Road will host its annual Summerfest celebration. Joining us in studio to tell us all about it is Pike Road Mayor Gordon Stone. Mayor, this event kicks off the 4th of July weekend. This is always so much fun. Well, it's, it's a tradition in Pike Road to celebrate our community, to bring people together, to, to create that spirit of connectivity throughout all of our neighborhoods. And we just happen to be called the Patriots. So doing those two things around the 4th of July just makes sense. So we want to kick off the Independence Day week by having some Summerfest the next uh, uh, Thursday night or tomorrow night at six o'clock, and we hope everybody will join us. What all do you have planned? Well, it's a typical kind of get together summer afternoon experience. You come, you, it's free for first of all. Secondly, parking is right there on the site. The site's off of Trotman Road at our new Agriculture Recreation Performing Arts Park, where the ball fields are and the Ag Center. And then when you get there, you'll have the chance to enjoy kids' games. There'll be uh, bouncy houses and blow up slides and all kind of things. There'll be food trucks, I think five or six food trucks. There'll be DJs playing music and people can connect and enjoy each other. And then just as the sun goes down to the west, you'll see a beautiful sunset and to the east, you'll see a great sky lit up with fireworks. And thankfully, Amanda has 0% rain, <laughs> so obviously it's gonna be a great night. But, is, but no matter what the weather is, y'all always pull this off. I know in previous years there've been some storms and somehow you still get those fireworks in and it's one spectacular. Year, one year we were monitoring the weather and they said you had 20 minutes, so we said fire now. <laughs> <laughs> and I think they, they went off just dark enough to see them. But you know, it's a, it's a great team effort. We have so many wonderful volunteers from our FFA to our some of our athletic teams to our Kiwanis Club. Our, our council members have been so supportive. Our town has been supportive. All of our neighborhoods are aware of this. And we just hope people will come out. And we hope people from the River Region will come and kick off this celebration. You know, I was thinking about as AAA was being interviewed. One of the ways you can avoid some of that crowd is start your holiday with us on Thursday. You're a little bit ahead of all that traffic. Go ahead and get your fireworks in ahead of the 4th yeah, and then just kind of hang it home well, it's, on the holiday. You know, it's, it's inviting for everybody, even sure. if you don't live in Pike Road. That's right. And, and it's important to celebrate America. We wouldn't have the freedoms we have without all the blessings of that, that, that have come from our Constitution, all the things we learned in civics class, all those in our area from the military that have served, all of our first responders. We just kind of throw all that into, the, into this and we celebrate all of those things as well as the upcoming 4th of July events. Give us the details one more time. Okay, so it's on Trotman Road, which is take 231 South, take a right, and it's just there about a mile off, off of 231. It'll be a six o'clock opening. Uh, parking is right there. No cost. Picnic, fun, family friendly. Fireworks at dark. Uh, no alcohol because we want to keep it as family friendly as possible and no tents. But other than that, bring your picnic basket. Bring your pet if you want to. Just make sure you have them on a leash. But uh, just a great way to connect 70 neighborhoods in Pike Road. What a great way to, for us to connect. All the cities of the River Region, what a great way for us to connect. So we just want to, we want to extend that invitation and say, come join us. We'd love to have you. Let's celebrate what we have, our greatest blessing, and that's the freedom we have in this country. It is a great time. All you got to do is at 231 South. I always say once you pass Sweet Creek, and then you see that next Troy sign on the right, you turn right that's there. Right. Go past Easy Sweet to find. Creek and take the first right, and then it'll be just right there on your right. You can't miss it. That's Mayor, right. thank you Correct. so much for joining us. We appreciate it's it. It's a pleasure. Well,